I think I met you guys in LA. How are you guys? Uh, yeah. I did the hey you guys. Hey, yes, yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so you play deaf. I do. How would you go with playing a role such as this? Um, well, you start with incredible source material, which is what we have in The Sandman, and then you do an incredible amount of research on something that there is an incredible amount of art, literature, you know, everything about. Um, and then you kind of have to take all that and try and make it, give it humanistic characteristics. You do it so well. Your opening sequence, I had to stop. I had to stop it because it was so emotive and so emotional that I was just like crying already. So, so like, how did you start with that whole human interacting scene with death? Well, I think, um, I mean, Tom is an incredible scene partner and he was so dialed in and so locked in as Morpheus that I think that anyone who worked with him was sort of allowed to fully submerge themselves in the role. And then, you know, between conversations with Neil and conversations with Alan, it, you just sort of find a way to bring this character to life. And I think what's so beautiful about the character of Death, most people are so used to like the doom and the gloom is she brings this sort of like beauty and dignity and, and sort of like caring nature to it. And that's something that I really sort of connected with. Yeah, there's a wonderful moment where she kind of imi imitates what mothers do when they greet yeah. their children. Absolutely, yeah, I, I do believe that this is a very, I think Neil created and I was allowed to sort of take that and run with it, a very maternal, nurturing side of death that we don't often think about or associate with the concept of death. Absolutely, and is there an episode we should look out for, apart from obviously your opening episode, okay, yes. like is there one that we, my episode. your episode? Well, actually what's really interesting is episode uh, five, before my episode, I was so shocked by, shocked and actually delighted by how much of it was so close to what the comic is and that as a comic book for fan of the comic was really really sort of like really I don't know very very warming and 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 it felt like you know a, a very respectful and a nod and, and honoring those fans that have been with the comic since 1989. Ladies and gentlemen you're watching Hey You Guys! Hey You Guys huh? Is that from the Goonies? Nice. Hey!